Hey, Orange One here. So we are back diving down into the lab. It's not been too long since I was doing this, so I kind of remember what we were doing. Um, but it's... It, I, uh, I really think we need to, like, find a place to just blow a hole in the wall, basically, from what I remember. Um, which honestly could be just, like, south of here, but I don't know kind of hard to tell with the the lab layout it looks to me like maybe to the side here and down might be the edge and that's the library there so that's almost certainly an edge right so why don't we actually go ahead and do that it's just going to make our lives a lot easier hopefully this works as intended i don't know if it will but if we go all the way Oh, this isn't the library, what am I saying? We go like here and we like blow up some dynamite there. Where's our dynamite? Yeah, get that out. Um, so if I light that and then throw... Oh, hold on, is the dynamite activated? Oh, I need a source of fire. Oh, what? Oh, this is out of... No, that's not out of gasoline. What? That's... That is extremely disappointing. I'm sorry, I'm just going to debug in a lighter because that's due to the, the things uh, that, that we updated. When we updated, I should have a lighter on me. Um, I do have a lighter on me. It's the frustrating thing. <laughs> you know? Let's see, lighter. Here we go. Yep, and then can I throw that right there? Can I run? And I'm gonna just make sure we got those in. I think that that should be long enough. Um, that did not blow a hole in the wall. Okay, well, never mind. That didn't work. That's a shame. I guess those walls are tougher than I thought. <laughs> uh, let's, let's get out of here. Let's skedaddle and get our temperature not to falling below comfortable. That's right now, it's comfortable. Um, okay, well, let's see. Maybe... I can just, uh, I was gonna say chill, but then I realized that's so punny. It just waits till you catch your breath. I think because we're comfortable here, I'm, I'm okay with going down and exploring more down. Let's see what do we have here. And then we were looking here. I went up and over. Wow, I really went up and over. Okay, um, I want to continue to kind of explore along some of that. Uh, maybe have our gun out just have it ready in case we need it there's like a weird gore pile there that I don't know if I created that and it, with any gore pile if you don't know if you create it you should be a little bit cautious <laughs> it's words to live by right there see who says that video games don't teach you anything about the real world <laughs> um okay we are getting chilly now and our temperature is falling that does concern me actually yeah we gotta get out of here man ice labs i gotta just bounce yeah safe mode can deal with itself later um okay here we go we're kind of not dying right now it looks like okay yeah it looks like we're kind of not dying 
Perfect. That's all I ask. I kind of am curious because I thought the thermal electric suit gave you thermal electric socks. But I don't think it does actually now looking at things. Um, can I actually reload our thermal suit with a battery? Um, sure. And I'm going to dump one of my batteries in here. My lowest charge one. Yeah, let's do that. And this does look like it's got more charge. Good for it. Uh, I mean, now that I've got the lighter, do I want to get more explosives? Because the other, last one that I tried to use didn't really work. Do I have more dynamite? I do. Let's see, can I just look at what explosives Wait, we have? <laughs> A mini nuke. <laughs> we have C4. Actually, we could do that. But how do you how do you use this again? I mean, do you need a remote detonator for this? It comes with a small timer. Okay, so we could we could use that C4 um, to probably blow a hole in the walls as we need. Okay, let's try let's try that again. Gonna try another deep sea dive. And we'll see what we can find down here. Okay, there's a wrestler there. I think we went from this way though, right? That was a little bit faster. From what I remember if we go down here. Where do I wanna go from here? Here? Yeah, okay. So we were just right there. Good spill off to the side there, that's gonna be pretty short, and then that's kind of a longer um longer haul. Let's try actually hold on. I was I was thinking about blowing that hole in the wall. This right here looks to me like it that door we we kind of failed to get through is this a library no this is not a library this is a prisoner containment area which i suspect that that means that this is probably empty let's try and blow a hole in this right here yeah we're gonna do it if if i can do that that would give me a really nice little spot to try and explore from right here we're gonna do it right here sorry um, set the timer to, I don't know, 30, and then dump the C4 there. Okay, so if I look there, it's active. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Stop running. 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. Maybe I don't want to corner myself. Oh, did that... That deafened me, I think. Did that blow a hole in the wall, please? It did. Do these... Oh, no. This is not going to be exempt from the temperature rules of this area. Oh, no. Now we got a hole coming at us, too. Maybe it, it will be. Let's, let's kill the Hulk, and then we'll deal with it. Yeah. How are you doing there? It's got arterial bleeding. Oh my goodness. Um, auto. Now, how are we doing on the damage there? It's gonna go down. I'm just curious if I let it get closer. There we go, okay. So it is down. That's a pit, apparently. Probably don't want to step in a pit. But maybe I do, is the thing. I'm going to turn off the heartbeat. I know it's super annoying to listen to. Let's see, I'm just trying to 
get a grasp as to what my options are here. I don't see there are any planks around us, are there? There are. Okay, there are actually a couple different planks right there. Um, can I just get one of them, please? I just want one. I don't have any space for a plank. Yep, just get one. I just am curious if this wall tile, what was a wall tile? Uh, nearby. If that, yeah, it looks like it does still have the same temperature rules, unfortunately. Okay. Well, I tried. Uh, we need to get out of here if we're not going to die of frostbite soon. Okay, let's run out of here. We might need to get our adrenaline going soon. Because we're actually going to start getting hurt. Okay. We're we're good. We're fine. We're not going to die from that. Uh, cold labs. I'll have to try and do the C4. Another C4 somewhere else. Somewhere that is much more likely to actually be a location that out of their work. <laughs> right? Okay. Um, any more C4? No? No more C4? Or is it C-4? It is C-4. I have a couple of these laying around. I might as well just bring a couple of them with me. Okay, you guys can come back with us with the sound. I mean, it's not very much sound. I think we're still deaf. Yeah. <laughs> it is what it is. We'll go down and we'll try and, and do that again, kind of. I really just need like a nice little spot for us to um be down at okay let's see what if i go down here i'm just curious where does that put me here okay and is this the lowest yes yeah, this is the lowest we've gone down what have we seen over here nothing what if i um try to blow up Uh, let's see. Let's go ahead and drop that right here. And I'm just checking. Yep, that's the active one. Good. Get those in there just in case this time. I think that that, yep, here we go. That, what do we have here now? Rebar cage. Can I see? What is that solid rock? I can't go. Uh, what is this? So it's a rebarb cage. Um, if I try and get another C4 down, I wonder if it will blow up more stuff here. I'm going to try it. Let's do another 30. And can I put it here? Uh, no, I can't. Let's put it here again then. It's for science. I think that... Yep, here we go. Let's see if that, that gave me a little safe space. Yeah, this is what I'm talking about, guys. We got our little safe spot. Now we can we can explore this whole area pretty comfortably. Hopefully we'll get our hearing back soon. <laughs> I think we de deafened our character for quite a while. Okay, we are a comfortable temperature though. Um, 
And let's go ahead and make a little expedition out from here. I mean, it's not a very central location, but... Um, what is that? A radio tower? Okay. I'm intrigued. I'm definitely intrigued. Can I maybe get my gun out instead of carrying around a, a plank? Seems kind of like a silly thing to do right now. Okay, there is a storage area. Shocker Brute. Great, that's going to be really fun to fight down here. He's going to shock me any second. Yeah, I just need to get a shot out before. I can't. Um, yeah, he's going to cause all kinds of pain for me. Okay, we're struggling to stand. Can I just smash him? I just don't want him game back up. I know that's kind of dumb. Some people might argue. Um, I'm going to go ahead and just try and get back here to recover. Because that was kind of gnarly. That was a lot more of a, a battle than I was anticipating right there. Let's just dull some of that pain. Get those repair nanobots going a little bit. Maybe I should turn off one of those. I don't know. Is that the one that's... No, I think it's the repair nanobots. Maybe not. Oh no, it's coming back up now. Okay, cool. Let's get that chili back up to comfortable. There we go, and I can hear again. Yay! <laughs> we have audio for the episode again. Apparently we've got an MP3 player going. I'm just curious also about our surroundings on this floor. Yeah, why don't we go ahead and explore this floor a little bit more. We know we've got another floor down below. But it's clear of that shocker. Right? We do know that. Oh, look at this. Is this a CBM room? Yeah. Just a cranial flashlight, though. And, <laughs> like, the two most useless CBMs out there. Do we have a map of this surrounding I don't think we do is this one of those rooms that should have a turret in it though oh experimental lab bot that's weird let me guess it's hostile yep it's hostile to me and I don't have a magazine loaded because yeah I didn't really plan that one ahead get that out Maybe stop running. I do really like this tile set. It does look good. Oh, um, you got a man hack there? Wait, didn't I just reload you? Okay, let's just get that out. I think we want to take this guy out. I don't care about the man hack. Oh, whoops. That was auto. I meant to do semi auto. Okay, got some man hacks for me. Oh, look at that Disp disposable heavy battery. I will take that battery power. Thank you. Yum, yum, yum. What do we have here? Yep, lo log me in. Uh, let's get the map data. I just kind of wanted to see the surrounding map area. Because, yeah, there's probably, like, I suspected some good stuff for us to know about surroundings like that farm. Is this, what is that? Oh, look at that. Chicken coop, this is like a proper, like complicated farm. Is that another lab? Oh my gosh, there's another lab. Okay, well we're gonna have to go there, I guess, when we're done here. <laughs> I thought I was gonna be done with labs. I was saying how I wanted to go to the hub, like I think last episode maybe. That's, uh, I think we need to head back, maybe, to our little hidey hole. What is that? Thin smoke. A little weird. Yeah, let's head back to our, our hidey hole to recover our temperature. 
I'm glad it worked, though. That would have been embarrassing if uh, that didn't work. Is it? It's not a above from here, is it? It is. It must be. Or is it just down here? No, it's, it's straight down. Okay. Uh-oh, we're getting very cold, guys. We're gonna start getting hurt from it, I think. Okay, here we go. We're fine. Oh, man. These deep labs. I think someone was telling me about starting fires near the stairwell and and then just hanging out by the fire for a little bit. That seems to work. I kind of like how this is like a permanent solution, kind of. Okay, let's see. Where could we go from here? I think we kind of would just make our way back up here, kind of far away. Unfortunately, let's just kind of get a, run, a nice run going. Get our breath out a little bit. Not all the way. Okay. I get nervous in games like this just holding down a direction key. That's like how you how you just like straight up die, you know? Oh, purifier serum, nice. Um, and then I think I'm just gonna cut up here. Oh my gosh, what is that? Is this just empty? Fungal floor, okay. It's the tile is, is really just, it doesn't have the fungal floor. I'm sorry, I'm gonna switch back to, um, yeah, this one. Is that, yeah, it's gonna be hard for me to address otherwise. Um, okay. Computer. Dead zombies. I think we could probably leave this part of the lab alone. <laughs> uh, before we get super chilly, though. Let's have a look here. Oh, that was weird. Oh, because we were looking at eyeglasses okay sure um oh no <laughs> what was that what was that we don't need to go there and we're getting to the point where we need to start falling back temperature wise okay I think we could maybe, eh, I mean this is pretty much all explored out. I think we need to just go down to the next level when, when we can, when we're warmed up. Okay, uh, let's just, yeah, wait here for a little while. And I'm going to switch back, just because... I do want to support the uh, other tile set as much as I can, make it normal. It is, it is a good one. They put a lot, a lot of time into it and made a really cool thing here. Um, okay. That was the long way around. <laughs> There's also another floor down from here. Why? Why would you do this to me? <laughs> this is insane. And a hasbot. Oh, okay. I think that might be the finale then. A zombie scientist and hollow fish serum. I'm just curious to see if there's any books that we can see from here. Nah. Okay, well, there could be some good stuff in here though. There are quite a few zombies, though. And it's cold, man. Okay, let's see. Uh, yeah. It's like almost too cold to really explore. 
I mean, I do think we need to explore this though. This is this is worth investigating, and this is close to um, our way out of here. We even pull these guys kind of this way. Yeah, we can shoot these guys and take them out. Okay, there we go. There's a couple of them down. Gonna keep on walking back. Um, yeah, we need a caustic, oh, it's a caustic soldier zombie, oh my gosh, guys, it's like all the adjectives you can fit on one. If they take longer to rot, do they take longer to respawn? You guys know that? I think it, that is the case, because they have to get like to a certain stage in the decomposition to respawn, but I, I don't know. Okay, um, I'm gonna go down, make sure these guys don't get back up. Oh, hello. There we go. And I think that's all of them, maybe? I don't know. Uh, caustic, yeah, we're gonna wanna be careful with you, you could get acid everywhere okay good I think that we're in the clear to um, check these yeah see there's like a there's like all kinds of serum and, and mutagen in here you know lots of good stuff slime glob so yeah, apparently blob blobs and slime are different. I did not realize this. I've been playing this game for like forever and apparently they're completely different lore wise. <laughs> um, what are these right here? Some serums? Cool. Alright. I will take it. I may not be able to make my own serum, but I'll I'll take what you've got here for me. Oh, there's a plutonium slurry. Cool. Um, what do we have here? I think this is where we had some more mutagen. No, uh, is that it? No. Here we go. Now grab the super glue as well. Maybe stop running. And. I think we'll probably, there might be some good stuff up here. There can be. Eventually. Uh, some fish serum. We got actually quite a bit of fish serum from that. My goodness. And now we're chilly. Uh, what is that? Okay. I'm just curious about what room this is. Oh, it's like an observation room. Okay, there's a technician there. He, he didn't get my gun. He could have pulled it away. Um, I think I'm gonna fall back here. And, yeah. We're getting near the end of the episode. Okay. And we're safe. Kind of. For now. We're safe for now. <laughs> oh, man. Uh, thank you for joining me. This has been Orange One.